So, we just um, demonstrated the chocolate roll. I've got my assistant here, my very handy assistant, going to help me with making the vanilla roll. It um, has two tablespoons of flour in it, as opposed to no flour from the chocolate roll. So I'm going to prepare, again, the jelly roll pan. It's so similar to the last cake I demonstrated. Uh, maybe just a simple bit easier because there's no chocolate involved. No melting, no stirring of the chocolate. Very simple again. Just get the parchment paper in the jelly roll pan. I'm going to set that aside. And we're going to separate the eggs. I think I told you in the last demonstration that it's easier to separate eggs when they're cold, but you want to make sure and um, whip the eggs and the egg whites, especially the egg whites, when they're room temperature. They whip up so much better. All right, so now we've separated the eight egg yolks from the eight egg whites. I'm going to whip up the egg yolks a little bit here, um, get that going, then add the, the sugar to that. Go ahead, dump it in. There we go. All of it. That's a girl. Thanks, Soleil. Okay, so we've beaten it to the point where it's a very light yellow. And um, I have had to experiment with this because uh, making a chocolate roll into a vanilla roll, it didn't work if we just had the eggs and the sugar. It just, uh, it just didn't work. So I discovered that I have to add a little bit of flour. So here's two tablespoons of flour. Soleil, you dump that in for me. Now those are a light yellow. The egg yolks have been beaten to a light yellow. Dump that in. Thank you, sweetheart. And because it's a vanilla cake, basically. Okay, so I'm adding, um, I'm adding a teaspoon of vanilla, two tablespoons of flour. I'm going to mix that back up together again. All right. Now I'm just going to whip the egg whites. They're over here, and they're in my mixer. So I'm going to do what I did with the last cake, which is add one-third of the egg white into that to make it easier to fold. So Soleil, watch this. I'm going to dump the egg white right in there. Once we get that going, it's going to be much easier. There, that's a little lighter, and then it's easier to fold the rest of the egg whites into there. So in they go. And this is my vanilla cake that I'm going to fill with fresh raspberries. Um, you can actually do, I've always, I've never done anything except fresh raspberries. That's the first time I made it. It's so delicious that way that I've never done anything uh, differently than that. But you could do, use your imagination and do any amount of, um, that you wanted to fill in that cake, whether it's blackberries or blueberries or combination of fruit, whatever you want to do. I'm ready. This is, looks so good. And in it goes in the pan. And then once again, 17 minutes in the oven. And that's all there is to it. We'll whip up some whipped cream, um, throw raspberries in it and roll it up. And it is one of my kids favorites, favorite desserts. In the oven it goes. It's cooled off enough that I'm just going to take this. There it is. And now we're just going to remove the parchment paper, making sure it doesn't stick along the way. Sometimes it likes to stick a little bit, but it pulls off pretty easily. I've made um, the jelly roll um, vanilla and the chocolate, and since I've done them, and I've, I generally do this anyway because I always make a vanilla one so that my son Craig can have something to eat. I'm just doubling up the whipping cream right now, and we'll whip that up, add a little powdered sugar and vanilla, however sweet you like it. I don't like it terribly sweet, and off we'll go, and then I'll show you how to roll these up.
Okay, so this is getting, it's, I'm going to whip it more, but it's getting close to, you know, holding its form. So I'm going to have Grace add powdered sugar. Go ahead and dump that in for me. Just dump it all in. I've, I've put it like four tablespoons in there, which is two tablespoons for each uh, little container. And I'm going to just throw in a splash of vanilla. Oh, thanks, Soleil. That's great. Um, and then just keep going with the whipping. Get it a little firmer. All right, so here we are. This is um, holding its shape. It's not too overly whipped, though. You don't want it too overly whipped. And now I'm going to frost the chocolate. Well, I'll do the vanilla roll because we got the raspberries here. And if I don't do the raspberry roll quickly, we're not going to have any raspberries left because my assistant is getting ahead of me here with the raspberries, which I'm very happy to see, Soleil, because they're very good for you. You like them? You're going to stop eating them or are you going to eat them inside the cake? So we are about to have a yummy, yummy raspberry roll with some whipped cream in the middle. Okay, here we go. Oh, we're going to still be eating the raspberries, aren't we, Soleil? When I've been in a hurry before, <laughs> I've made a mistake and rolled it short and fat. But you do want it um, rolled so it's, the, it's as long as you can do it. So you've got your parchment paper, and you just start to roll. There we are. There it is. I've got my tray. The tray right here. It's so late. We're going to wait until, and then I'm going to just plop it right there. I can slip the parchment almost out. And... Um, Sometimes I just cut it out, but this is coming off beautifully. There we go. There is the raspberry roll, and I'm going to trim it up so it doesn't have a jaggedy edge, and that's for you, Soleil. Mm -hmm. And here's another jaggedy edge over here, and it's hanging over the plate anyway, so we've got to have somebody eat that. That's for you, Grace. Mm -hmm. There you go. There is the raspberry roll that is, you can see, the end, too, how it's rolled and beautiful. Um, it's absolutely delicious. I'm going to throw a few uh, raspberries on top before I serve it, and I'll show you what it looks like when we decorate it a little bit, and you can decorate it however you like. We have uh, the completed raspberry roll that Soleil can't seem to keep her fingers off of, but we've decorated it, and there's some kumquats that I threw on there um, and just decorated the cake in such a way that it is an absolutely beautiful, delicious, wonderful thing, um, which I think we will enjoy very shortly.